building. The drama king is in the building. Yeah, I'm in the building. I'm going to hear myself, though. There you go. 888 Shade 45, Street Sweeper Radio. Hold on. This nigga getting on my nerves, man. Who? Yo, yo. Trill, I don't know what he's doing today. Off. Being true. Just turn the volume. You got it? Yep. Like- 8 and 8, Shape 05, Street Sweeper Radio, K Slate, John King in the building, Ashley Ray in the building. We got another set of lyricists in the motherfucking building. Uh, Fred the Godson in the building, Joe yeah. R. Ortiz, and we got the arsonist. Yeah, Heat makers. Heat yeah. makers. Not the rapper, just the just the producer. Oh, yeah, I, I mean, you know, that's why I came back to your last, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's why right. I came back to your last, bro. Right. You know? So what's going on, fellas? We cooling, man. How you feeling? Working. I can't complain, man. Every day above ground is a beautiful day. You yes, better sir. believe it. You know yes, my sir. slogan. You know what I'm saying? I but was you. this green shit on purpose? No, no. Nah, nah, we said that shit like, yeah. <laughs> we said, how the fuck everybody like, got green on? Nah. This shit on purpose? Like, nah. Uh, Joel like, pointed it out. I'm colorblind, to be honest. It's with crazy you. <laughs> that you noticed it, too, though. Like, because we all, I, first all got to the studio today, then I got to the studio, then Fred walked in. I'm like, hold up, this was the vibe, huh? Yeah, yeah exactly. Crazy. Yeah, you know, I mean, y'all all in front of me, so it's hard. It's like very 90s you know groupish. Like oh, some, some voice to men shit or something. Right. <laughs> oh, shit, I don't know about that shit. <laughs> you know, you know, that acapella shit. <laughs> but um, what's going on, fellas? I know y'all got a new project, right? Yeah, yeah. Gorilla Glue. Yeah. Mm. You know, it's crazy. Did it for the streets. Yeah. Um, getting all kind of... Billboard hit us and you know. it got it, it, it charted on the R&B hip hop charts without a dollar of promotion behind it. Wow, that's a good look. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, all right. It's yeah, I'm fucking with I it. mean, I've been playing the joint you sent me. Yes, you know sir. What I'm Move the crowd, right? And I realized that it was the whole project. I'm like, well, I only got one joint. Yeah. Like, who, 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 who do I get at about that? Austin? No, I'll send it to you. <laughs> like, I'll send like, it to like, you. I only had that one joint. I've been playing it since it came out. Now, when oh. we leave here, I'm going to send you a zip file of the whole yeah, project. I, I need that, man, because yeah, I, I like you. to have different selections of shit to go for. Oh, you know? I, sent, I, sent, I sent two over. Okay. And we know you, and we know you're gonna yeah, this actually cup, play this the should, record. This your cup of tea. I know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is I know. shit. <laughs> directly, right. directly, man. Right. Right. So, what made y'all want to do this? Pro- I mean, I know y'all been doing a couple of joints here and there, but what mm. made y'all want to collaborate on this project? I guess we was like, you know, we was up in our studio, working on separate stuff for so long and bumping heads before we got cool. And all be like, I'm telling you, man, y'all, y'all niggas need to just do a joint together. Yeah, I'm telling you, like, he's been saying this shit forever. Yeah. Like, so, for like three and a half years now. Right. So man. we just start fucking around with certain freestyles and shit. We'll put a clip up, fuck with the people, then pull it. You know what I mean? Be like, ah, oh, that ain't no thing. And get back to what we do. And then we just found the little zone after we recorded like one or two. And we just like, yeah, let's just knock out a couple more joints, see what happened. And here you have it, the glue. Okay. Uh, yeah. So um, what joint we going to get to first? You can play Kilo. You got Kilo in there, right? You got that? Yeah. You got yeah. Kilo? Yeah. Let's drop that. I will ask you for mercy. The Drama King is in the building. The Drama King is in the building. Hey, today, Shade 45, Street Sweeper Radio. DJ K Slate, Drama King is in the building. Ashley Ray is in the building. Hi. Kind of, kind of thirsty today. Yo. What you mean I'm thirsty? <laughs> The way you was in front of that building wasn't right tonight. We're going to talk you about that later. You swear I was outside selling cooch. I was not. I didn't say, who said that? <laughs> you said I was. Wait, wait a minute. I who even said saw, that? When you rolled up, when you rolled up, even how you was looking at me, you was looking at me like you thought I was a hooker. You didn't know it was me, but you no, thought I, I was a you. hooker. I want to know what the fuck would you stand in front of the building like that for? <laughs> I was just how, how, are you, how are you standing? I was I was smoking my weed pen, so I probably was just, you know, I was high. In your zone. Yeah, you know. I got you. See? It's okay. Speaking of Gorilla Glue. <laughs> it's okay, <Ash. laughs> <laughs> Speaking so, of gorilla, it was it ain't look right, Slay? Like, at all. I was <laughs> hot. <laughs> and then now she's throwing ass selling into the quays. I didn't say nothing about that. I, I did kind of. It, it was hooker ass the way I looked. It so, was hooker so, so you know you ain't look right. This is what I'm saying. Like. I have a hooker ass thing about me though in the wintertime with the coats on. It just kind of looks like I get it. it Somebody like, yelled at me recently like how, how much? much? Yeah. No. no. <laughs> Swear to God, it happens no. all the time. Listen, y'all see the yes, direction wow. of this. Y'all see the direction of this. You see who's initiating it. Don't me to me five years from now. You understand what I'm saying? I'm just telling my story. That's right. You you are the one who uh, 
implicated selling ass. No, I, I've, I've never <laughs> sold downtown. ass. No, I said you implicated in yeah, this conversation. Yeah, yeah, it was me. Selling ass telling downtown. We didn't. Okay. Just telling my story. So <laughs> I, how do you respond to that shit? Like if somebody says that, like you just polite with it? Like no. I'm... No, I'd be like your mother. Like all types. So I turn into a whole New Yorker like when that happens. But Damn. you get disrespectful. Yeah. A little bit, because, I mean, you know what? Guys snatch me up on the street all the time. I don't know if... Or they grab you? Yeah, so I'm always having to turn into, like, a little pit bull in a skirt. But not a hooker. Just not a hooker. (laughs) Why do you feel they feel like they could approach you in certain ways? I think I look approachable. You do? Yeah, I'm always smiling. I'm always high. You, yeah, you can't look too happy in New York. Right, right, right. Yeah. And if let, don't let me say hello back. That yeah. means I'm, I want to suck somebody's dick, obviously. like Clearly. I mean, right, yeah. you know? Right. So. I mean, so he, he feels he has a shot. Right, right. Yeah. Just you understand? a high. Females, too. They think they might be able to get some head from you, too. Like, it goes both we ways can. in New York. No, in New York? Oh, sorry. Nigga, yeah. chicks is, is battling for shit, too. You understand what I'm saying? So it goes both ways. No, I'm good. I know you had just shared that too. What? <laughs> Damn. Oh, you know. I, I, <laughs> Yo. Whatever. I, 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 will, I will. I will. If I like somebody, I'll. And they dudes don't pull the trigger. Like dudes who actually Yo, I would be interested in, they don't pull the I'll trigger. Say, so say I have that to. And then just look away like this. Oh, so you, you'll press. You'll press. I won't press. And I'll be like, Yo, give me, you gonna ask already or no? Like, you know, like, can I see? Like, just give me the phone. Are you gonna give me the phone? Like, are you gonna ask or? Got you. <laughs> All right. I mean, it is what it is, no, yo. No, no, like, you know, shit. Like, shit. I'm not mad at that. I mean, everybody if, doing I, their own I thing, got, man. I got time, like, you know. Like, Look, you only live once. You might as well just do the nastiest shit you can do while you're alive because you're dead. <laughs> <laughs> it's over with. You understand? This what is the yeah. first conversation <laughs> before the conversation about eating ass. Anyway, like, <laughs> no. nah, I don't. I don't uh, anyway, we're gonna make a heart right off of that shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, Fred the Godson. Yo. Austin is Joel Ortiz in the building. Yeah, yeah, we here. We cooling out. Just played that first joint. Kilo. 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 You understand? So you know the tone of the uh, the tape. We t- took it straight to the to the concrete, to the granite. That's yeah. what that always. Yeah, the make. project is fire. Word. It's, well, n- it's nine you, songs and it's dope. And you produced everything. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. yeah we got okay. one. We got, <laughs> they said of course. I mean, you know. It's only right, right? You I might think as well. the only feature on it is Jim, right? Jim and Drama. For drama, Jim, Drama yeah. did the chorus, yeah. Jim Jones and Drama. So, so, so uh, uh, go, ahead, go ahead. Where'd the name come from? Joel came up with it. Yeah. <laughs> why? Like, what, why that particular name? Oh, I just feel like me and Fred, you know, we've been gorillas in this shit for so long, and now we actually teamed up. Really? We're sticking by each other. So I play, <laughs> it's a play on the word glue and gorilla. Okay. Plus, niggas don't want no smoke with. No, they don't want no microphone smoke. Nah, yeah. it's been a while, you know what I mean? Like, we, you know, we definitely have the respect in certain, yeah. you know, aspects. Niggas don't really want to play like that with us. There's going to be somebody I, to hear that. I really that thought it was about That shit going to turn into something. Just all. Nah, <laughs> nah, 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 Because <laughs> really what I know is that real lyricists respect each other. Yeah, like, of course. Like, like, just like, I don't give a fuck how nice a nigga is. I'm not going to be up here talking about the nigga better than me. Fuck out of here. Right, nah. like, you understand? Yeah. That's, that's just how it is. And plus, you yeah. got to understand that, like, the, you know? the environment of the studio is different, man. Like, whoever comes through, like, even the record that Jim is on with him, Jim got busy on there. Like, you can't get on a record with these two and expect to do some... You can't take a bar off unless you're going to get exposed on a record with two dudes that's not taking a bar off yeah. in any song. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so, you know what I mean? It's different. It's just the way we, we, we came up. That's really all it is, bro. Like, I got into rap because I came out my building and the projects and there was a cypher in front of the building. I didn't know what the fuck it was. So I'm like, what what is this crowd? Let me walk over here. And niggas was just trading off rhymes. And I'm hearing, oh, oh, you ever tell you that? And it's just like, I, I thought that's what you had to be. Like if you wanted to be, if you wanted to be considered one of the greats, you had to wow people with the way you played with words. Exactly. It yeah. had nothing to do. With, I'm talking about before song structures and ad libs and everything. Right. Before I was even a trip to the studio, I was like, if I want to be a rapper, I gotta have niggas being like, yo, this nigga is crazy. You gotta. Exactly. Actually and rap. I've never let up from there. Like even when I approach songs, I listen back like, yo, niggas do have to say. Although I'm, you know, telling them something with subject and content, they still have to listen back and go, yo, but that nigga's crazy. Real and that's how I, that's what I stand for, and that's what Fred stand for. Right. Okay. You know I know. Yeah. Shit. So we, you know, Gorilla Glue is the is the project, and so nobody else thinks. I thought it was about weed. It's I mean, it. yeah, it's all of that. It's yeah. everything wrapped up. Yeah, everything. All, right. of all of that. All of that. Everything. Pills. Yeah. Everything. Whatever it is, it's the hustle. Oh, okay. It's the, exactly. The exactly. Sorry. Exactly. <laughs> 
So did you think about the Bronx Zoo at the same time too? Being that they said gorilla? Like I'm just curious. Nah, I just that's what I like, you know what I'm like what? that's the only gorilla like, glue I know. You know what I'm like like, you like fuck to- it, like you know what I'm saying? You you went there, you also went there too. I mean that's the only You like that strain? That's that's my of choice. Oh that's your strain of choice. Yes. Got you. Okay. Nope. Yo, <laughs> let's play some music <laughs> while I say some other shit. Mm-hmm. Yo. This is uh, Hallways. What's the next set we get to? Hallways. Hallways. Drop Hallways. that shade for a while. The Drama King is in the building. The Drama King is in the building. Yo. Hey, today, Shay for five. Yeah, you're the artist radio. guy. <laughs> okay, Slick John King is building Ask Me in the building. Friend of God's son. Here we uh, go. Arsonist, heat maker, Joel T. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> see, you know when cats want to be artists or they step out their zone, I'm always the first person to get kicked in the ass with it. Mm. And I remember, you know, at one point, you, you was going to be But I'm, I'm going to keep it real with you. Like I tell everybody, out of every DJ, Slate always showed love. I'm talking about from day one. Like, I tell any DJ that to their face. I told multiple Automatic. DJs that. I say, yo, out of every DJ I've ever met, K Slate was the only one that never did not return a call, did not answer an email. If he didn't fuck with something, he was going to tell you I don't fuck with it. But he was at least going to give you the, res- the respect of a response. Mm-hmm. You know exactly. what I'm saying? So, I just... Shout out to you for that, man. I don't know if I ever told you that, but shout out to you for that, definitely. I oh, appreciate that. Aw, solid. Because I've, 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 know, I've known Slate for like That's probably like fact. 18 years now. Yeah, you, you know, know what I'm saying? Long time. Long time, man. Listen, man. Long time. When I, was in, when, it, when I was first coming up in this shit and I was at the other station that he had, he was, I mean, I would wait, because you would wait outside, like, yo, I got to bump into this nigga, but it's, the, it's your <laughs> only shot. <laughs> it's your shot at radio. If you can see this nigga. Yeah. And then I remember, I like, finally seen him. I'm like, yo, yo, Slay, what's up? I rap. He's like, yo, 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 yo just you, give, give me it. Let me let me listen to it. <laughs> like, it was no, like, yo, have your man. It was just like, you got it with you? I right, give it to him. It's fire. I'll play it. Yo, yeah. short, short enough. He must have heard it. Was just like yo. He was like yo. I ain't gonna front this nigga. It's nice. I was trying to yeah. side yeah. 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 I was trying. To, I was trying to. Yo, yo my nigga. Yo. I was like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? There was, there was some other shit going on. Hell yeah, man. That's the funniest funny. shit in the world was. I never forget. And I'm not gonna mention names because niggas is cool. But we had a cipher going on at the station. And a certain individual, you know, my man, he called up bragging on his man. What my man do, whatever this and this and that, I whatever this, this and shit. that. I was like, he kept, man, I got 5,000 on this and that. I was like, come on, we ain't even doing that up here. Man, fuck that nigga's scared. I said, all right, I got 5,000 on Joel. Joel looked at the son, dude was like, Man, come on, man. We ain't even up here doing that shit, man. <laughs> like, we ain't like, yo, yo, son. Niggas did not, yo, it yeah, was yeah, like, no smoke. Like, yeah. you know, but it was love, though. It's not like all it was love. no, yeah. it was all love. It, I ain't shitting, but it was just yeah. like, I was like, wait, like, oh, no, no. I'll put my money right there. Like, because I know I'm, I'm going to be 5,000 rich. <laughs> right. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I'm doing that. I appreciate that, you know? man. Yeah, but that's what we that's what I'm saying. That's where we come from. You get what I'm saying? Like yeah. so Slade, you know, you know right off the rip when you, when you put some put you press play, like you got in ten seconds you know if somebody's about it. It don't take much for you to be like, nah, this nigga got it. Yeah. yeah. Like, you know what I mean? We all know what that's like. You know what I mean? We yeah, don't gotta yeah. listen to a whole joint. And that was back yep. when when you had it, nigga had to like Shout out, remember niggas came through the stew yesterday. Shout out to um Rest in Peace 2 5. Yeah. Uh, but he used to hit me on the come up, like, yo. Yo, Fred, come down to Mount Vernon right now. I got this bread on you niggas just talking crazy. And, and you know, <laughs> it don't usually be the rappers. It be the big homies that's backing the, the All rappers. The time. Yeah. Like yeah. they gotta brag and they gotta have bragging rights. Yeah. So five was like, whenever niggas start talking, I'm calling you. I'm like, right, let's do it. Fire, son. <laughs> I remember just hopping off mountain bikes and shit like, like you just Dang. see niggas rapping and just be like, yo, y'all rap? Like, yo, I get y'all, 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 y'all mean we get me and my man can spit? Like, yeah, hey. And just looking around at faces like, all right, we got to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> but, sir, you don't remember? I remember going with my girl, going to the movies, and just having a, in my head, like, we're going to go to the movies, we're going to eat. And, like, around 8.30 at night, being in Harlem, surrounded by 100 niggas battling some nigga I ain't never even seen before. It just, that's the way it just happened. You had to have the bars. Like, you ain't know the nigga, but yeah. the nigga knew you because your name ring bells. Exactly, yeah. But I'm you had to have some shit. And if you didn't, if you backed out, you were scared. Bro. That shit went faster than the fucking internet. Right. <laughs> Before you went home, niggas like, yo, I heard nigga punch your ass up. Yeah, you yeah. yeah. You scared yeah. this nigga. I'm like, yo. Niggas be at my window. Then around my way, they call me quick. Yo, quick! 
Yo, what up? Yo, niggas out here rhyming. All right, give me like 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Just because somebody from outside the hood was out yeah. here rhyming. <laughs> It was like, I, 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 I think y'all fire. All right, my son on the way down. And I come over there. That was good. It was good. It's always love, though. That's why yeah. I've always loved rap. Yeah. Yeah. Before I even became a rap, I always loved it because it was the only thing besides yeah. basketball where complete strangers would put all the drama shit aside. Like, nah, it's all good. It's love. I know I don't know you. You don't know me. But you rap? All right, we got something in yeah. common. We good. It ain't nothing else going yep. on. Exactly. And you just be like, yo, where you from? All right, cool, niggas. Rhyme. And I'm in the back of my head like, I hear all right, but he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> like, that being nigga. And I know my mans know it, too. So I'm just like, all right, cool. I just step in. Yo, yo. And that first ball to go out, you just see something. So, <laughs> Can't get that look. Can't get that look. Like, oh, why y'all call son though? Like we was good. Two father called me. The DIY called me in the middle of the night. Tell me to meet him in Undercliff in the Bronx. This nigga think he nice. It'd be like two in the morning. I'm like, yo, who man? Him. All right. You gotta give him the business. You Crazy. know what I'm saying? That's what it was it's always about, like man. that, man. That's what it was all about. It's it's, it's it's tough. It's tough to like to hear some some current stuff. And kind of the, you know, what's getting pushed into the forefront when you come from that. Exactly. Yeah. It is tough. Not, not no hate and shit. Nah, Everybody get your no money. Hate. It's the truth. Thing. But right. it's just tough to be like, word, damn. That's rap. Yeah, like, cause you had not only, not only is did did some dudes take off a little bit on the bars, like on a skill level, like you know what, I don't, I don't want to be skilled, but like, they also have the way to just get their music out no matter what. Yeah. You yeah. get what I'm saying? Like, right. I didn't. I was in a project. In the street, if I didn't get a record deal, that's where I would have stayed. Right. Exactly. There was if I, somebody didn't validate me and say, "Nah, I'm signing him. He's going, and now he's going out." You stay in the projects. That's you, couldn't press, you couldn't press upload. No, yeah. there was no nothing. Like right. you know what I mean? Yeah. I had to stay outside. Yo, what time Slay usually get here? Mm-hmm. All right, Craig. Yo, here go my mixtape. You had it, it was valid. It was all like, yo, listen, if it's not, and that's what made music crazy good though. Yeah, because yeah. it was filters. Like, nah, that ain't it, fam. Like I was talking to this young nigga <laughs> on the gram, and he was like, how? I'm like, yo, listen, just imagine if everybody in the streets knew your name and you was nice, but it wasn't no Instagram, it wasn't no Twitter. He was like, how the fuck did that happen then? <laughs> Yeah. Like that's just how much we had to hit the streets. Yeah, it's crazy, crazy that they that's just can't imagine work. that. Right? But, like, but, that's but, crazy. But, but, <laughs> Being even, talented. but look, they can't even imagine that. But then you had to imagine back in the days when house phones existed, when niggas didn't have cells, and the way you would catch up with your friend, you would call his crib and say, "Oh, excuse me, Miss Johnson, did did uh, Fred leave yet? Yo, yo, he left about a half hour ago." And you know, either to go. To the basketball courts, right. 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 you understand what I'm saying? Right. Like around the Johnny Pump, when niggas were shooting the pump, like you know, it was about five different spots yeah. right. to try to catch up with your people. When no you they didn't have no cell yeah. phones with the beepers, it yeah. wasn't none of that. Nothing. Right. And then what was even crazier than that? How in the '80s, I might be going a little further back. No, but I but love the it. '80s, mm-hmm. say it was a park jam again. Like, you could just walk, be walking towards 125th, they'd be like, yo, man, they rocking over there on 110th Street Park and Park Avenue. They got the equipment out there. Or, yo, they rocking in 18 Park across the bridge in the Bronx. It's just like word of mouth. Right. Yeah. And when you get to the park, it's hundreds of people out there. Yeah, you understand what I'm saying? Like, through word of mouth. Word wasn't, of mouth. Through word of mouth, how the whole hip-hop would pull together. Come yeah. outside, yo, they got the break dancing going over in Schaumburg, Floor Masters, and I'm like, what? Everybody start heading there, and as you going, you seeing people, yo, we going over to Schaumburg, they break dancing over, like, it was just yeah. crazy yeah. the way the culture human was. In, it was actual human interaction. Exactly. You it wasn't none saying? of this shit here, this lost in face shit. Right. I, remember, face. I, re- yeah. I remember, like, you know what I mean, being, being with my mans, we'll be at, let's say, Coney Island, and you see three, four chicks over there. Like, yo, I gotta go say something to her, man. It was the only way you had a chance of bagging somebody. Right. With right. no DM. You, you, I never go, you go over there, talk, you, you, how you doing, you know, pardon me, da 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 da, and you come back to me, yo, you got a pen? That was the right. thing, like, yeah. oh, you caught the number, right. sir, ask for a pen. pen. <laughs> got the pen. They yeah. get the number now. She tell you, yo, all right, cool, I call me like five. Like, you had to call at that time, or you might have never, ever got through. It's over. Or you might have called, and her brother, like, who's this? <laughs> yeah. The hater. What? Who's this? Or the mom. Oh, yeah, that was You understand? Father, Whatever like that. Father, hey, you, know, you know what's so crazy with that phone <laughs> yeah. shit? I was just telling Joel every um, other day, my stepson, he locked up, but one time he was, I, I, I punished him. I had him on punishment for like a month. So, 
when I was going to take him off, his, his girl was coming to the crib. His girl knocked on the door. I went upstairs and said, yo, listen, your girl, up, your girl downstairs, you got have company. He said, man, I'm sick of her already. I'm like, how the hell you sick of her already, nigga? You ain't going nowhere in a whole month. You've been punished. Like, nah, man, be on FaceTime with her and everything, man. I see her every day. And I'm that just shit's like, crazy. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. like when yo. we was oh young, nigga, when punishment, you couldn't see nothing. Nothing. Nobody. Yo, I do you oh, one I better. I take my son's phone, so I don't know what you're talking about. You remember, you remember yeah. that? You remember the mm-hmm. one, the one chick that came around your way only during the summer? Mm-hmm. And you <laughs> after the summer, it was just like you just it never over. saw again. The relationship, <laughs> <over. laughs> relationship was over. It was over, man. It was over. It's different now. Dang. 8 today, Shade 4 5, Street Sweeper Radio. We got another joint over here? We got something else we can play? Yeah, it's called Feliz Navidad with Jim Jones. Let's drop that, Shade 4 5. Yeah. Yeah. The drama king is in the building. The drama king is in the building. 8 today, Shade 4 5, Street Sweeper Radio. K Slay, drama king in the building. Asher Ray in the building. I want to thank y'all for coming through. Thank Sitting you. down with us, flat. Fred the God, Sandrell Ortiz, Arsonist. Uh, make sure y'all get that new project out right now, Gorilla Glue. Yeah. You yes, know what I'm saying? Thank you. Some bangers on it. Uh, I do need that there. I'm going to send it to you tonight. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yes, tonight. don't forget, because, you know, I got to play it down the block tomorrow. Gotcha. So I got to gotcha. get edited, because I know y'all ain't made cleans. Cause this one is actually clean. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> niggas is lazy <laughs> now. They don't clean joints. They like, man, fuck it. Do it yourself. Nah, I put it on the internet. You want to clean? <laughs> it's up to you. You know what I'm saying? Niggas is. And like another one that we sent, it don't have curses in there anyway, hallways. So he could take that one too. There's like, What's yeah, the other good. one I sent? Kilos might have a curse in there. Might have one or two. But yeah, but. <laughs> we, we'll get you the right yeah, stuff. Yeah, okay, get yeah, get them to me. Y'all want to shout anything out right quick? Yeah, the glue. Gorilla glue, yeah, man. Gorilla Make sure glue. y'all download that. Pick Fire. it up. However, y'all going to listen to it. Just give it a listen. If you fuck with the street shit, then that's your shit. Yeah. Uh, nine nine, nine quality talk. records. Yeah, I, I can't wait to listen to the whole shit on my own time. You my know you. what I'm saying? Yeah. Appreciate that's what it. I need to do. Look, okay, fire. again, thanks for coming through. Yeah. Shape 05, keep it locked. We got the next guest coming up, RJ Payne. Yeah. Chattanooga Oka Murder.